Hello, I'm Simon Lukoski, the founder of The Collective, inviting you all to take part in our Collective at Christmas 2024. We have three songs uh, for everyone to learn. Uh, as ever with The Collective, it is free of charge. Um, we just want to get as many people singing as possible. Uh, you can attend our live Zoom sessions. You don't have to, however. You can just learn the songs and submit. Uh, all the information will be provided to you. Uh, and I'm going to share with you our three songs uh, for this year. We like to do Christmas in quite a big way here at The Collective. Uh, and we would love as many people to sing with us as possible. If you are in a real in-person group uh, and one of your in-person groups would like to sing any of these songs, that's also absolutely fine. You can record your in-person groups. Again, we'll share information on how you can do that. Uh, and yeah, we're looking forward to getting going with Christmas. So uh, let's start off with our first song. Now, of our three songs, uh, they're all arranged by me, but two of them are original compositions that I've done specifically uh, for the collective. Uh, so the first one um, may end up having some bells in it. Um, that's to be that's to be confirmed. Uh, but it's called "Ring Those Christmas Bells." Uh, looking about the bells, ringing out the old and ringing in the new. Uh, really hope you enjoy listening to this one. This is the first of our three Collective at Christmas songs. Ring, ring. Really hope you enjoyed that one. Uh, so that's the first of our Collective at Christmas songs, Ring Those Christmas Bells. There's some interesting rhythms. Uh, there's some stuff to get your teeth stuck into. Uh, but the parts, uh, it sounds complicated, but the parts on their own are not too bad, I promise you. You do have to have a little bit of counting, though. But we'll be obviously looking at the rhythms uh, in the uh, Zoom sessions. We'll also be putting those Zoom sessions uh, online in folders so that any of you who can't attend Zoom sessions can watch those uh, recorded rehearsals, get the tips and tricks you need to master uh, any of these songs. You don't have to sing all of them. You can sing any of them that you like and any of them that you don't like. Well, blame the arranger. There we go. Uh, so on to our second song. Now, in this country, in the UK, uh, we have... Um, primary schools so like infant schools um they they do christmas in a specific kind of way with their kind of primary school songs one of those that i remember from my youth and a lot of a uh, lot of you will remember from your youth is the song little donkey uh which what which i arranged last year for some of my in-person choirs um it's not quite the usual version of little donkey the primary school version is quite simple uh, but it's, again, I just, I've always liked it and it gives a real sense of nostalgia. And again, with Christmas, 
that's what Christmas is about for me a lot of the time. It's that nostalgia of those days gone by when we were small and our nativity plays uh, with tea towels around our heads pretending to be wise men and shepherds. Uh, so this version of Little Donkey is a little bit different. Uh, it's uh, in multiple parts, in a cappella, and uh, it gets a little bit dramatic uh, in the choruses. So uh, this is our second song for the collective at Christmas. This is the wonderful Little Donkey, as you've never heard it before. So, hope you enjoyed that one. Uh, there's some big bits, there's some choral bits. Uh, there's little, the little in kind of instrumental where there's going to be some narration over that. Uh, it's a really fun song to sing. Some of you uh, are in my in-person choirs here in Leicester in the UK. Uh, and you've sung Little Donkey and it's a really good, fun sing. Uh, and we think it's going to be just as fun um, singing it with the collective at Christmas. Uh, you can, um, in all these songs, you can sing multiple parts. So you can sing more than one part if you want. Uh, it's about quality and not quantity. So we always want you to sing well, as opposed to not singing lots of the parts very well. We'd rather you pick a couple that suit you. Um, and this next song, you definitely will want to be probably singing more than one part. Uh, the alto line, I think, is quite, it's, it's almost one note throughout. Uh, but this uh, next song is an original composition I actually did last year. Um, I did a Christmas advent calendar last year, which I think I'll be, I think I'll be doing again this year, dependent on time. Uh, but one, this is one of the songs that I composed just for that um, Christmas advent calendar. I've uh, since gone back, I've looked at it, I've kind of edited, tweaked, made it slightly more interesting for the harmony parts and things. Um, and this one is called The Sweetest Gift. 
Uh, you can sing any of the parts. There'll be information about the, me the main melody and what we're going to do with that. Um, there's a couple of opportunities, um, a couple of thoughts, chant uh, like you know, options that we could do uh, with that. So this is the third and final of our collective at Christmas songs. Uh, it's called The Sweetest Gift. Uh, and yeah, it's it's really, really lovely. I have mixed opinions about some of my compositions, uh, but this one I really do uh, think is quite um, quite special. And I really do enjoy listening to it. I really enjoy singing it. Uh, and I really enjoy putting all the resources together. Uh, so this is called The, S uh, the Sweetest Gift. Um, really hope you enjoy.
Okay, so as you'll probably hear there, a couple of those parts are quite simple. Um, but again, it's the, the harmonies are in support of that overarching melody with those words. Um, with those words are really important for me. Uh, and that song is all about the words. I wrote, I wrote the words last year um, in quite a short period of time. Uh, and just uh, when I chatted uh, with our collective exec, they were like, yeah, that, that's a song that the collective would really like to sing um, with the lyrics and the harmonies and the, just the general feel. So we have three songs for you folks, three songs, very different songs. Uh, you have Ring Those Christmas Bells with its rhythms and its exultations and celebrations uh, of, the, of the winter season um, and all that that brings. You've then got uh, the primary school banger, as we call it uh, in this country, uh, of Little Donkey uh, and some really good fun to be had with that song. I can only imagine the video backgrounds that you're all going to be choosing for Little Donkey. There'll be many, many donkeys, I'm sure. Uh, and then we've got um, The Sweetest Gift, which is, um, I would even say it might be classed as classy, uh, but again, a very different uh, style. Uh, and again, a very different um, kind of song for us all to learn together. Now, you can um, come to Zoom sessions. Uh, you can um, come to as many or as few or no Zoom sessions if you want. Uh, we'll be running these uh, through October and November and into December. Um, we're generally trying to run at similar times of the week on similar days. So people get used to, oh, well, this is my collective session is at this time. Uh, we'll share all those timetable information. Uh, obviously, we have our collective members page that you can all uh, uh, request to join on Facebook. Uh, but even if you're not on Facebook, uh, you can still get all the information you need. We have a resources sheet which has all the information you need, all the links to guide tracks, all the links to when the Zoom sessions are, all the deadlines, everything you need. Uh, we're going to be recording uh, rehearsals for you. Uh, we are also going to be um, sharing audio tracks, video tracks, scores. Uh, some of those scores will be annotated. Uh, and you're going to get all the resources you need so that you can uh, learn the song in your own time, uh, in, the, in the comfort of your own home, that you can take it to any of your choirs who might want to sing any of these songs. Uh, any of these songs are fine. Just get in contact and we can chat about how your choirs, in-person choirs, might want to get involved as well with any of these songs. Uh, and yeah, it's just going to be really, really fun. So uh, if you are a, a, an experienced collective singer, we're looking forward to seeing you in Zoom rooms uh, as ever. Um, and if you, are, if you haven't sung with the collective for a while and you want to sing one of these songs, please do. We would be lovely to see you again. If you've never sung with the collective before and you're just finding this on the internet somewhere or someone sent it to you, please do come and join us. Uh, or just learn the songs and submit. We'd love to have your voices and your faces. Again, voices and faces, you can choose whether you share both or just share one. Completely up to you. So uh, I am still Simon Lubkowski, uh, founder of The Collective. We have a wonderful music team who are ready to do the work with you, to spend time in Zoom rooms with you. And uh, yes, we are very much looking forward to getting going with this. Uh, so we shall see you soon. doot de doot And take care. Collective at Christmas. Back for another year. See you later.